for the first time on the podium. Now, finally, your time has come. Congratulations, winning. My first race win was pretty cool. It was in Punta del Este in season one. What a stunning setting it is for a motor race. It was, I think, race three. And then he managed to, to win the race. Are you happy with uh, starting off the grid in fourth position? Well, I mean, uh, we are only happy if we are on pole, but uh, at the end of the day, fourth is much better than where I've ever started before. I mean, from here, you can, you can do something, clearly. We go green in Uruguay, and it's a great start. Second for John eric Bird. It's third for Sebastian Buemi. We were really quick in practice, but the first two races didn't go so well, so it was pretty nice to finally hit it and, and, and get that first win in Formula E. It's victory for Sebastian Buemi and Edams in the third round of Formula E. Finally. And now, finally, your time has come. Congratulations, winning the third round of the Formula E race. Yeah, thanks a lot. Yeah, it's been a, it's been a, it's been a very difficult journey so far. But today we, we did everything right, so I'm I'm more than happy. I'm delighted for the team, for us, because uh, it's been very difficult. And now we we finally uh, you know win our first race. So really happy. All right, thanks very much. Jean Paul Junior, you must be ecstatic right now. What? Uh, <laughs> uh, yeah. My first race win in Formary was the second ever race of Formary in Putrajaya, Malaysia. I turned up there still on the back foot after a pretty poor pre-season test. And somehow we were in a league of our own in Putrajaya. And what a superb performance this has been on so many levels from Sam Bird. Dominant performance. Yeah. Still unexplained as to why, but um, it was a comfortable win. They couldn't stop Sam Bird, who exits the final corner and wins in Putrajaya, the second round of the FIA Formula E Championship. In Hong Kong last season, season five, definitely a strange weekend, especially a strange end of the weekend, because we got the the win, let's say, after the decision, the penalty, let's say, of uh, Sam Bird with the contact with uh, Andre Lotterer, and uh, so we couldn't really celebrate on the podium, but yeah, hopefully we will get like some more like in the future. My first Formula E win was actually in Berlin season one. For the first time on the podium, Jerome D'Ambrosio. First time on the podium for Dragon as well. But thing that really felt like a win was actually Marrakesh last season. Two wins I had before that were ended out to me after the race. Really winning on track is different. Well done, mate! Well done, mate! My first race win in Formula E, I mean it's my only race win so far, but that was in Riyadh this season, round two. Having started from pole position for the previous two races and, and not won, the, the pressure was mounting somewhat. Basically we needed to win, I mean you, you don't normally have three pole positions and, and not win a single race. In, in round two we pretty much controlled the race, brought it home. It was uh, pretty cool to, to stand in the middle of the podium in Formula E, done it. A limited amount of times and then it always feels nice but yeah to now have won a race in Formula E which is the the biggest racing series I've ever been a part of yeah certainly one to, to hold in the memory and tell the grandkids one day. My first win in Formula E has been this year in Santiago de Chile of course it was a very emotional day and um, yeah it started really well with a good good qualifying putting the car in the front row in P3 we, we've been quite smart in the way how we used our attack modes. With the second one we got into the lead, was able to manage the, the situation while being in the lead quite well. And this gave us a good opportunity for the end of the race when Antonio came uh, closer and closer, even overtook me with a few laps to go, but in a better situation uh, because we managed, managed well before. And yeah, I could put pressure again on him and finally made the overtaking move with with uh, three corners to go and of course a lot of adrenaline in this race and yeah a very special way probably the best way how to, to celebrate the first victory in Formula E and it's definitely a day I will remember for a long time.